I would say gymnastics is is four or five different sports into one. And that is kind of very hard to wrap your mind around. Like on rings, you need strength. But on floor, you need to be quick and powerful. But on horse, you need to be more, more agile, you know? And you kind of have to combine all of those uh, attributes of each of them to become the best, I guess, all around it, per se. But you can also be your best on your event, you know? And there's so many different s selections and what you can do that it doesn't really just stop at gymnastics. I think it just kind of shows that everyone has a home somewhere. Like there's so many aspects of the gymnastics that if you come in, and this is why people kind of get so jealous when you're able to access it, is you will find a home. You will find a place where you connect, whether it be team-wise, whether it be socially-wise, or whether it be within the six events in men's gymnastics. There's just so many aspects that you can get into. It kind of leads you, shows you what you like and where you fit in on the gymnastics team in the sport. I think what's unique about gymnastics and the only other sport I can think of is like diving, similar sports kind of. Uh, it's a team-based sport where everyone's points are combined, but you have your 30 seconds to 60 seconds of just you. And that 30 to 60 seconds feels like an hour and it's super nerve wracking. And it really, everyone's eyes are on you. Uh, the pressure is built up and you know you have to perform. And I think throughout four years doing that, probably 100, 100, 200 times, it really built up my ability to perform under pressure. And that relates to uh, like job interviews. You have five to 10 minutes to wow your interviewer, just like how you have that set amount of time to get as many points as possible. And it is a team sport, but that 30 seconds of individualized time is very important for growth, especially for 13, 14, 15, 16 year olds who might be going into their first interview for their job, might be interviewing for their college, that if they don't get that exposure. In basketball, there's 10 people at a court on the court the entire time. Not everyone's staring at one person for 30 to 60 seconds.